When people ask me my favorite subject, I say it changes depending on what class I'm in. When I'm in English, my favorite subject is English. When I'm in math, my favorite subject is math. Prep does a really great job with stimulating intellectual curiosity and it fostering the love for learning, and it's one of the cornerstone values of our school. So when you ask me my favorite subject, my answer is yes. The way that our students learn is very different than perhaps we have learned in the past. The days in which teachers would chalk and talk no longer exist. We're looking now at mastery learning techniques, higher order thinking skills, research by students, project-based learning initiatives. All of this is supported by technology. The iPad really has the potential of transforming how we learn and how teachers teach. So our goal is to teach them responsible use of technology for learners in the 21st century. My shadow day experience was very important at prep because it gave me insight to what the actual day-to-day -day life is. I noticed how at prep I was going to have to develop my own sense of responsibility and my own specific work ethic. I never had a free period before and that kind of opened me up to bouncing a, like a work social experience um, because there's obviously a lot of time where you can be with your friends but you can also be working in the academic center. And also opened me up to what the academic program is actually going to be like and I knew that it was serious and it was gonna take work, but it was definitely well worth it. I think what's special about Fairfield Prep teachers is that they have to be what we call good Ignatian educators. In Jesuit schools, we have an Ignatian methodology that we use. The other piece of it, I think, is, is it's really important that we hire teachers and form teachers who don't teach subjects but see people, and that they model certain values that we're trying to inculcate in the students. As an Ignatian educator, part of my role would be to challenge my students to be more reflective, to look back on where they've been and look ahead to where they're going, and to really think about how best to get there. It, you know, the fall of every year is a very exciting time in the Guidance and College Advising Office. We begin to welcome a parade of college admissions visitors from colleges all over the country. One of the dynamics here is that our seniors are involved in the process, but our juniors see it, our sophomores see it, and our freshmen see it. So they know what's coming for them in terms of their ability to interact with college admissions reps who in almost every case will be the first reader of their application when they apply to college. The reason why I sent my son to prep is because he's a very social kid and so I wanted him to be able to focus on school while at school. I think we've accomplished that by sending him here. The comments when he got into West Point, <laughs> one kid said, way to one-up your brother. <laughs> yeah.